So let's start with what is OpMonitor? Well, OpMonitor is a tool that has been designed for the asset managers to be able to visualize the condition of the asset in real time. And this tool utilizes obviously different information. So we utilize historical data, uh, test results, and continuous monitoring data. And is OpMonitor a monitoring system? Uh, it's way more than a monitoring system. A monitoring system is supposed to be a standalone unit that collects some information and provide uh, alarms. In, in our case, our monitor utilizes condition mon continuous monitoring system to determine the asset condition in real time by combining such information with uh, other information relevant to the asset. Can a customer use our monitor if they don't have continuous monitoring installed? Yes, of course. So in case there are no continuous monitoring system installed on the assets, we utilize historical information and test results to evaluate the asset condition. In fact, many non-critical assets, they don't have a monitoring system installed and they're not going to have it because of the cost of the assets. Does OpMonitor have a continuous monitoring system? Uh, yes. So we develop our own solution to monitor the partial discharge on electrical networks. And uh, that with the intention to be able to cover the majority of the stationary asset that you have on the site with a single device. And what about customers that already have a monitoring system installed? Can they have access to OpMonitor? How will it help them? Yeah, so if the customer already have their own monitoring system installed, we can uh, uh, connect to their systems and uh, export the data and utilize that data in our OpMonitor platform. So overall, would you say that OpMonitor is a solution for every circumstance or are there circumstances that OpMonitor isn't going to help? I believe OpMonitor has a solution that allows to cover every circumstance of the different sites.